the south african government really spend millions on a single building and social media lessons well this is what we'll be talking about in today's video so please do all to stay glued watch to the end do not forget to subscribe and do turn on the bell notification button so you can be the first to get notified when we drop a new clip well in this particular video we are going to uncover a shocking story of financial mismanagement within the department of sports arts and culture war minister gayton mckinsey recently blew the whistle on two instances of wasteful spending that have left south africans outraged join us as we delve into these revelations well minister gayton recently held a press briefing where he revealed alarming cases of financial mismanagement in his department these disclosures have sparked widespread outrage and raised serious questions about how public funds are being used. The first case involves a staggering 20 million rands spent on buying a building for just one person. Gayton expressed his disbelief at this expenditure, questioning why such a large sum was allocated without clear justification. In the second instance, 4.5 million rands was spent on teaching people how to use social media. Yes, you heard that right. 4.5 million rands on social media training. Well, McKinsey couldn't hide his incredulity as he shared this information. And many South Africans are equally baffled by this particular level of spending. Well, to better understand the gravity of these revelations, we need to look at the broader context of government spending here in South Africa. Financial mismanagement and corruption have long plagued various government departments. Efforts to combat these issues have been ongoing, but incidents like these highlight the challenges that remain. Minister McKinsey took office with a clear mandate to clean up his department and ensure that public funds are used responsibly. His disclosures are part of a larger effort to bring transparency and accountability to government spending. Well, let's actually talk about the first issue, 20 million rands for a building. This expenditure is particularly shocking because it raises questions about the decision-making process within the department. Why was such a large sum allocated for a single building? Who approved this expenditure? Believe me, these are questions that need answers in order to better understand the rationale behind this decision. Talking about the next one, 4.5 million rands for social media training. Spending millions on social media training seems absurd, especially when public resources are meant to address more pressing needs. This allocation reflects poor prioritization and oversight within the department. How did this expenditure get approved and what measures are in place to prevent such wasteful spending in the future? Well, the public reaction to these revelations has been one of anger and disappointment. Many South Africans are frustrated by the misuse of taxpayer money, especially when there are so many other areas in need of funding. Opposition parties and civil society groups have also condemned these expenditures. Democratic Alliance spokesperson Sole Malatsi called for immediate action to prevent further misuse of public funds and demanded a full account of how these decisions were actually made. Minister McKinsey has vowed to address these issues head-on and ensure that every rand is spent wisely. His commitment to transparency and accountability has given some hope that meaningful reforms may be on the horizon. What? These revelations highlight the need for greater transparency and oversight in government spending. Guys, what is your take regarding this? Drop it just down.